time I got that heat, let's go. So I'm doing some gaming here uh, with the um, LG Velvet. And, you know, just playing this first game here, I don't see too much difference from uh, the previous uh, video I did with um, the V60. Uh, this is gonna be one of those situations where, you know, you're being really thorough and, and trying to figure out, you know, uh, if you can find something wrong with the device when it comes to performance. And that's pretty much what I'm doing, you know, with, when playing this game. Um, just trying to find out if this device will have problems with lag or, you know, just if it's going to, if I can see any kind of performance issues. And so far, obviously, I've been playing. And so I hadn't found too many things that I dislike about it. But when you guys watch this, you'll pick out OJ. It had a frame drop right here. It did this. I just play the game. And if I feel like it's smooth, then um, I... Uh, move on to the next and so i've been playing my favorite game here obviously you guys know that asphalt 9 is my favorite game uh, one of my favorite games uh so you know with that being said why is it showing this um the phone plays asphalt 9 just fine uh so and this isn't a real graphic intense game so let's uh turn off the pad here and then i'm gonna go up and close that out and i'm gonna get uh the games here let's go to dungeon hunter so um yeah it, it feels good man i mean it feels good to game on this thing uh i guess the only difference i've seen so far uh in the v60 compared to this is might be the loading times and this is the first time i'm booting this game up uh and this game is a really graphic intense game and it's going to um um it's going to uh, show how how well the phone will do when doing um, the first boot on things. So uh, most most phones that I've played this uh, game on, it pulls hard. You know, it, it takes some time to to get it uh, get games started. Uh, but this phone right here compared to the V60, that's where I see pretty much the differences. Some of the loading times are, are a little different. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Uh, it plays the game. I'm sure it's gonna play the game just fine. Uh, let's skip this and let's just get right into it here. All right, let's move around here. I got vibration turned on. I'm gonna turn it off right here. The top button right there turns the vibration on. But uh, overall, it's looking like it's playing pretty sweet, man. All right, okay. You got me. R1, you get to do a little roll. It's looking pretty good. I don't see any reason why this game would not play well. I don't I don't notice any kind of frame drops or anything like that. Hopefully you guys are looking. Um and you can notice them. Okay. Yeah. I don't. I don't see. Um, I don't see anything wrong with it. Let's go down. And get there. There we go. There we go. Let's go over here. Ultimately, though. Um, 
gaming is going to be nice on this. I'm sure that they thought of gaming on this phone and they know that people are going to do some gaming. But what do you think about the real gameplay I'm giving you now? What do you think about it? So it plays that game obviously well. Um, let's close out of here. I don't want to make a really long video about games uh, because I know that the the phone will game right. Uh, but you know the 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 Velvet is going to do well, and it's going to do well with uh, if it can play those games right there. It can play pretty much anything, I would think. Um, there's that one game that you guys, Pub, uh, PUBG, you guys always want to see me play that game. Not playing it, but ultimately, uh, this phone has definitely been incredible to use so far. Uh, I knew gaming, uh, I knew Get Shot the Night. Man, he always hits me up when I'm doing it. <laughs> um, uh, you know, the, the phone is going to run smooth. If you're doubting the 865 to the... Um, uh, 765 don't waste your energy with it it's going to be fine uh, this this obviously they're offering this dual screen like this because they know that you might want to do some type of gaming uh, but you know the, the phone itself is absolutely great I'm really loving this for some reason it feels a little bit smaller well it is a little smaller than the v60 um, because it tapers off and it's got a nice slim body however I'm loving this in the case like the v60 I would normally take it out of the case a lot more but lately I've been using this in the case for pretty much anything except when I have to shoot a video with it or I'm working on the camera review. I have to obviously take it out unless I'm gonna use it in this sitting position like this for video, you know what I'm saying? Which you can do. Uh, ultimately, uh, it's running right along, man. I'm really loving it. I think the, um, I set up my fingerprint reader again. The fingerprint reader is working good. So I'll give you guys a follow up later on, but this video was about the gaming and the performance. And I haven't noticed anything different on this phone from any other device um, from day-to-day -day task and stuff like that. So I think you'll love the, the, the Velvet for what it is when it comes to working on your multitasking and gaming. The performance of the 765 is going to please. So there it is. It's your man Jay. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care.